Former Liberal Party power broker remains behind bars, awaiting sentence after pleading guilty to fraud. Damien Mantak was the state secretary when he diverted $1.5 million of party funds to a bank account set up in his wife's name. Here's court reporter Joel Cream. Damien Mantak was once a trusted Liberal Party official, but no more. The less said about uh, that, that individual, the better. He, uh, he's somebody who betrayed uh, not just the party, but he betrayed uh, every Victorian who supports the Liberal Party and wants it to do well. The 42-year-old pleaded guilty to 15 fraud-related charges, his family in court to witness his admissions. The prosecution told his plea hearing he stole more than one and a half million dollars from Liberal Party coffers over five years. Mantak used fake invoices to charge the party for printing, but then siphoned the cash into an account set up in his wife's name. He spent half a million dollars on shares, lashed out on an $80,000 car, $45,000 helped with the couple's home loan, and he shouted his wife a business a $600,000 cafe in Queenscliff. It was an attempt to keep his marriage afloat. He told police, I had a number of personal issues I wasn't dealing with, and this was the anaesthetic. His lawyers described an extraordinary fall from grace. This is a man who was rubbing shoulders with prime ministers, and now he's sharing metaphorical bowls of porridge with prisoners. Defence noted many months of police work had been saved by Damien Mantak's cooperation with the investigation. Upon being charged, he handed over every invoice and statement documenting many years of his fraudulent behaviour. The fraudster will stay in custody ahead of sentencing next month. Joel Crean, 10 Eyewitness News.